What's up guys, it was our last day in Hawaii. But for me to show you how amazing this holiday's been, I need to send you back five days to Universal Studios in Florida. <laughs> Okay, it's lunchtime. Apparently this is voted the best theme park restaurant in the world because it does awesome food, so I'm really excited for this. So. Went a bit heavy on the food earlier, so we're hitting our second session of the day. It's a bit of back and triceps now. Why not? We're in Rome, eh? Well, actually we're in Orlando. <laughs> Just turn your head to that, tilt the other way. Yeah. yeah. And pout like you usually do. Pout more. I'll tell you what. It's Dave Franco, everyone. It's Dave Franco. See, he's here. A very, oh, that's such a very nice thing for you to say. George is odds on. He got odds on wrong. He's got to do a house down the stage. I will do that. Yeah. I'm in. <laughs> 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 Turns out that George is amazing at doing handstands. My handstand was up there with the bits. We're about to go on the exercise ride. I, I honestly hate this film. I watched it when I was 13 and it scared the life out of me. Okay, it's still not too late to jump in that bit. So scared. <laughs> Leon, that was absolutely horrible. A bit like, just looking on YouTube, that looks like fine, but I can't explain how horrific that was. It was when the flashing lights all started, and it was just like... I put my arm on Leon's shoulder, and he pretty much pooed himself. So we're not going to film anymore tonight, guys, because we're not allowed to film in the next places. And also, we need to experience it with no light. So we'll see you tomorrow. Good night from Leon, good night from John, and good night from Dave Franco! Hey, good night! Wow, last night was amazing, but to be honest, it broke me. We got to like 1 a.m. and I was just so tired. The jet lag, I wasn't even jumping at things anymore. People would jump out at me and I'd be like, oh, I'd be like a zombie myself. I've not actually been sleeping too well recently. I can't remember the last time I actually got a full night's unbroken sleep. Something I need to fix, I have my electrical devices off, I listen to an audio book, so that's all good. I'm just, I'm just not a very good sleeper, which I need to fix. Um, oh, I'm on the floor. Um, Going up. And Leon just sleeps everywhere. But the, oh my god, those scary houses yesterday were frightening. The first two were the worst. American Horror Story and The Exorcist, which you saw. Oh. So scary. Oh. So scary. Today just got a whole lot more awesome. Yeah. Yeah. So far, we've not managed to make George crack. We're gonna. We're gonna make him crack. We've got another day tomorrow, and we've got all tonight. We're gonna. We're gonna. We're gonna break it. He, um, he's uh, he's getting a lot of banter from us, and we just want to see that he can do it. But on the other side of that, you should go and subscribe to George Benson. Now, I'll put a link up for him. Like, when you ride roller coasters, you obviously get really stressed, so your cortisol goes to the roof. And when your cortisol goes up, you take uh, sugars out of the blood. So I wonder if that's why you're always craving sugar after you go on uh, a ride. A bit like on Harry Potter after he sees the Dementors, he has to have chocolate. Okay, now the food here looks incredible. Oh, I've got myself some greenery. What do you go for? We've got some steak on there, some veggies. A bit of everything. Come for the mac and cheese in the corner there. That dragon just breathed fire and we all pooed ourselves collectively. We ran out of the shop like... <laughs> That's where we're off to for dinner. <laughs> that looks good. Me and Leon are up at 4am to catch our next flight, so I'm going to get about three hours sleep. I've got to pack my stuff up. So let's get on with it and I can get into bed and get a few hours kip. And then that will be the end of our universal journey, but we'll be on our way to Hawaii. We've got two six hour flights tomorrow, so it's pretty full on. Time to go, it's 3.30 a.m. to the airport.
thank you. We just had to do the whole embarrassing thing, well, not really that embarrassing, of making the suitcase lighter. It's so, embarrassing when you've got dirty pants at the time. Yeah. <laughs> Open it up, pull some bits out, and crack back on. Horrific air pollution. Yummy. Down on to the next one, got 20 minutes to get to it, and then it's another six hours before we see the girls in Hawaii. They're coming in fast. <laughs> it's, not it's not them! <laughs> Priceless! Leon totally didn't wave down the wrong Jeep. Leon was in the car waving the wrong Jeep down. This is a cool Jeep though, eh? Just come out to get some food, literally just checked in. There's a little whirlpool. This is amazing. Is that a little jacuzzi pool? Yeah, there's just little rock pools everywhere you can get in. Love this already. Get some food in my bed and we'll jump in the pool. And there's, there's a McCall called Rio who lives here and he's got trees. Parrot? Yeah, he's not Thai. Do you hear that? He's not Thai. What's his name? Rio. Rio. Rio lives here and he's. And there's McCall. Love him already, like me. He flies around and he dances to the music. When they play music, oh my god, that's so cool. <laughs> We're going to the beach um, to see the waves. Today we're going to go and do a hike, which is apparently 15k long, would you say, Rose? Yeah. 15k long, and is the sixth most dangerous hike in the world. So, yeah, so we're going to get some supplies. I think it's probably the best idea for this one. Is it rainbow jello? Are you, are you on for that? I'm kind of, I'm eyeing it up. I don't know. Is it, what, is it made from real fruit? Is. Je uh, jelly. How are you going to open it, though, gorgeous? I'll eat it at the hotel. Rose has an, um, apart from being scared of the camera, has an unhealthy relationship with mango. She's in love with them. <laughs> raining so it's a quick quick time to put the roof up. Go Leon get the roof on! So we're about to do this trek we're at the bottom now and it's already absolutely beautiful. So you've got four hours there, four hours back? Yeah. Depending on how we walk. I think we've only got time to do this one here. Hannah Capo Falls. Let's go, wagons roll. Go on, bro, you lead the way down there.
Our trek to the waterfall which was how amazing it was insane and we are now coming for some food and we thought you know what tonight we've burnt a lot of calories we'll have a few beers and we've come into the eating house which is really nice 1849 it's like hawaiian food and apparently it's called the eating house the first ever restaurant that was in hawaii it was called the eating house so um let's go and see how good the food is and i'm feeling like a cocktail or something so it looks like we're all going to be going for a burger but what i've also found is Check this out, bottled beer, which is peanut butter. Winning. But I'm gonna try something from around here, I reckon. One of these two. Everyone's gonna start getting worse and worse at their speech now, aren't they? Can't even with sangria, I you? have, and it's amazing. Rose? Mango something. Oh, I'm surprised. Okay, here we go. Today we are tubing, uh, which is basically where you sit in a massive rubber ring and you go down a river, um, which doesn't sound quite as gnarly as I think it's going to be. I think it's going to be pretty full on. Um, I don't know if there's one person in the ring. I don't know if there's four people in the ring. Hopefully it's four. Um, water's going to be pretty cold. So uh, let's get cold and wet. Was that guys? Really good and we got crisps and cookies. Rose, she's like, don't put me in the camera. So we're now gonna go and find this massive canyon, which is about an hour's drive away, and we're really cramming it in in our three days here. Just jumped out of the car, we've been driving for about an hour. Um, we're to the other side of Kauai now, which is the island we're on, which we also found out is the most rainiest country in the world. Um, hence why they can grow all the cane and stuff like that. But this side, we've only been driving for an hour, and it's gone from like green tropical rainforest, which took us five hours to trek through yesterday, to this. I am really, 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 well, we all are in love with Hawaii. And everywhere I go, a country thing I go to, we pick up a snapback. So I just picked up this one, which is Aloha. Um, from the Aloha Exchange, it's like this really cool surfing skateboard shop. Um, I got this vest as well. Um, and yeah, I'm just absolutely loving this place. It's a shame that we've only got three days here, but I will definitely 100% be booking a holiday back here because it's, you just, you, you can't. It's just amazing, guys. It's so amazing. full night here in Hawaii. I'm gonna face this way so you can see all that beautiful stuff in the background. Uh, Rose and I come for a, a little drink together and a little bit of celebration. Definitely gonna come back here. It's literally incredible. Hawaii's been beautiful. Um, tomorrow we go tubing and we leave at 9 p.m. so we have to get checked out of our rooms. Yeah, what an incredible, incredible place. Um, thank you for Virgin Holidays for helping us out here. It's our last day in beautiful Hawaii. See, the locals say Hawaii rather than Hawaii, and I feel like that's now how I should say it. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, I'm heading to the gym. Uh, I don't know if anyone else is up yet. It's about half past six. Uh, today, we've got to check out and put our rooms into Leon Carly's room, because we're gonna have a late check out in that room, and then we're gonna go and do a zip line tour and fly home later tonight at 9 p.m. So we've been super active on this whole day. We've, we've not been in the gym, we've been doing five hour treks, which really hurt my legs. Um, 
but you know you've just got if you want to indulge like we've eaten uh, out last two nights someone that's pretty calorific but well, I mean we didn't eat too much in the day and we were very active um, but you want to you don't want to go too far off the rails that you feel guilty or you start to impair the way you look so you're going to relax a little bit and hold this what you're here for at the end of the day but it's, it's nice just to keep tabs on things as much for your mental kind of health as, as your physical appearance the last breakfast buffet and we got the best seat in the house and I went big start on breakfast this morning. What? The reason I was filming our man's helmet there uh, with GMO free kawaii is because for 20 years the people in Kauai didn't know that um, that company in America or a couple of companies were growing GMO crops on the other side of the island so there's been a massive petition to kind of get rid of it because they want to be GMO free which is only a good thing. Wow, what a holiday that was. After three flights home, Hawaii to LA, LA to New York, New York to London, we are home. How, did you have fun, guys? Yeah. Amazing. Did you have fun, though? Yeah. We all look like squash turds. Well, I'll speak for myself I on that front. I like work for the NYPD. Mm, yeah, no, yeah, actually you could look like an American cop. So on that note, we're gonna go. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Um, and if you ever get a chance, check out Hawaii. It's incredible.